Hello everyone and welcome back to the series of Simulink tutorial. Today we will study how to implement a first order differential equation in Simulink. Now here we have a first order differential equation corresponding to a system whose input is R of t where output is C of t. Now we will implement this equation in time domain in Simulink and will find the step response of the system. Now before starting the implementation, we will make rearrangement in the first order differential equation. And we will use the rule that highest derivative of the equation will be left on the one side of the equation where all the remaining terms will be moved to the other side of the equation. Now using the rule dc of t over d of t will be on one side of the equation and all other terms will be moved to the other side of the equation as shown in the equation 2. Now equation 2 states that first derivative of the output or dc of t over dt is equal to sum of negative of 2 times output plus input. So for implementation in Simulink, we will use a summer for addition purpose and a multiplier for the negative gain. And now we will move to the Simulink library browser. And from library, we will add all the required components like a summer, a gain and a step input for the step response. The block of step response is available in the tab of sources the blocks of sum and a gain or multiplier are present in the subcategory of commonly used blocks. And for plotting purpose, we will use the scope. And we'll connect all the components according to the equation 2. Now in this system, we have a sum whose output is equal to derivative of c of t and for the value of c of t, we will use here an integrator. So we will move back to the library and will add an integrator to the our system. Now our system is ready for simulation. We will press the green button and simulation will be performed. Now open the scope and press the auto scale for proper visualization of step response. Thanks for watching the video. This was all about today and stay connected for more videos.